What is up guys, it's Jesse here. <laughs> What's up guys, Jesse here. So today uh, we bring you guys a little exciting little video. So as you guys know, Gus has an IS250. Uh, we haven't really shown that car too much because it's been a stock car since he's got it. Unfortunately. Uh, yeah, so finally he's going to go ahead and de-virginize that car, or this car because we're sitting inside it. <laughs> and he's going to go ahead and actually pick up an exhaust for it. Uh, it's actually a Tanabi exhaust, right? Yeah, Tanabi Manelin. He's actually getting it for a pretty good deal. And yeah, we're going to be recording our way over there and our way back because it's actually a hundred, almost 100 miles each way. So. You guys will get a little time lapse, but I'm sure Gus is excited to get this exhaust. Yeah, I'm excited. I'm just looking at two airplanes that are flying over there and driving, trying not to die. But yeah, I'm excited because the car's stock, and um, now I just eventually would get the white pipe and hopefully it'll sound a little louder. So we're gonna divergenize it by getting the, the axle back. Yeah, the axle back. And uh, should be a pretty long, boring, drive it's gonna be <laughs> yeah. about an hour and 30 minutes but we're in the 250 so it's comfortable you know Luxurious. we got music we got all this leather in here <laughs> we got the luxuries so we'll check up with you guys once we have it yeah. guys so we just finished talking to the guy who's selling the exhaust so bad news he was falsely advertising what he had uh, they were actually to pseudo uh, an exhaust for uh, that's what the exhaust is called to pseudo and he was just passing them off as Tanabi so after looking at the actual branding we noticed that they were fake and he just started basically saying that Giving us bullshit. yeah he was just basically saying that uh, uh, the advertising or the the branding on there was it faded away yeah it's the same <laughs> a lion on the actual uh the picture picture it, yeah. it said it on the tips so we thought they were authentic authentic and on the craigslist that it also said you know tanabi authentic exactly. you know tanabi stainless steel and you know i asked him for a picture and he sent me a picture of a tanabi exhaust but i guess he had just gotten it off the internet and then tried to buy it off his ass so he was basically trying to sell them for what he purchased those ebay ones for they were like, like 350 bucks new and he was selling them for 280 so no, he's asking his on his ad he was asking 350. yeah so, so basically what he bought them for so he was just trying to get his money back out of it so we just told him like you know what it's not what we wanted so we just walked away from it but it sucks that we actually drove an hour and 30 minutes just to come see the, like this exhaust and then it ends up not being what it was so it's just like you got to make sure when you're actually going to go buy parts that they are the Authentic. official like you should ask for as much pictures as you can get that's kind of something that we didn't do we got a few pictures but as you guys can see we just got burnt but as, at least we didn't just i still have you know the money in my pocket yeah. and i mean i wasted a little bit of gas but no big but yeah uh we we actually heard a sound clip and it doesn't sound that nice that exhaust so i offered them 120 bucks because it's just you know an ebay exhaust because i still wanted to you know take something but he wouldn't even take that so whatever it's fine we're gonna just start making our way back home <laughs> They got a couple cool cars here at Chemical Guys. We decided to actually do something with our day instead of just going back home. We got an FRS right there with some no XXRs. XXRs. Nismo 370Z over there. The zoom takes forever. They also got a little fastback right there. But this, this is a sexy ass little car right here. Ooh, stick she. That is stick she. That gets the approval. But that's a race car right there. Oh, look, the smart guys in there. You got those things on there? Oh, God, that's carbon fiber. That's so sick. Oh, that's just disgusting. Yeah, that's a So many decisions. I feel all my hopes. Make it up. 
why I lay those down before they. Back up, back up. Oh, wait, no, actually. Back up, back up. Bad idea to lay that, huh? Yeah, what? You don't think they'll spill? No. They're closed. And if they spill, then I guess my car is gonna smell like citrus last time. So we bought a few little goodies for the cars. You know, you gotta treat the girls because they treat you. So now we're gonna make that far ass drive back home because we well, didn't get shit. What we, got. we got some soap, yeah, you soaps. know? We got that leather and cleaner. And we got some all purpose cleaner. And we got some bug and tar remover because you know all, the, all those bugs are killing us. Yeah, because we experienced a lot of that because we were on the freeway a lot. So it's definitely going to come in handy. But yeah, definitely. That was like a little $70 trip that we just did there. Stay away from Craigslist scammers. Right. All right, guys, thank you.